Thanks, by the way, for uh, dropping me off. What? Yeah, whatever. Well, time to get used to a new home. God damn it. You didn't do one hour again. This thing freaking sucks. I should really get. Ugh. Good job, rookie. We'll have our defenses up in no time. Thank you, sir. Right. Let's continue our agenda. Boss. Huh. What is it, then? It's about Peter. He still hasn't repaired the radio like you asked. God damn it! That lazy ass. I don't get it. Why don't you guys just do it yourselves? Because we don't have the skills to. Peter does. Oh, right. He's the electrician. And a mechanic. I have never met such a hard worker who was so lazy. What do you want me to do? <sighs> Eric, go get Peter. Yes, sir. West? Um... Walk around, keep it an eye out. Sure. Well, I guess it's time to watch some Twilight Zone. What the hell do you think you're doing? I was just trying to get your attention. Jeez, man, calm down. Well, yell it out. I know you heard the rule not to enter my personal garage. Yeah, I heard about it. Ugh, fine. Let me lock this up. Call command. Tell him there's still people here. Yes, sir. Command? Peter. Sir. Yes, soldier? Soldier 24H2 has reported back from outpost Red 3. Recon has spotted four individuals. Hmm. Very well. Prepare for attack order 1, section 7. Onto outpost Red 3. So, Eric, why did you sign up? Or were you drafted? What? Oh, I just... just decided to. Even though you may die. I must have hit a nerve. Okay, just for me to know. Instead of me getting you to do this every time, how do you fix the radios? Well, first things first, this is a radio tower, it's... Very different from a generic radio system. Radios generally have an electromagnetic system of sending, well, I mean, <laughs> electromagnetic waves that transfer to wherever it will be received. Do you even understand what I'm saying? Um, slightly. It's the part with the electro-do shiny thing. How are you our sergeant? Ugh. 
Just get back to work. Boss. Sergeant? <laughs> Douchebag is more like it. What was that, Private? What the hell was that? Soldiers. Just drove up. Who? Don't know. What's going on? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What are we gonna do? Hey! You better stop firing or else I'll launch this rocket at you! Oh, shit. Move! Damn it. Killed no one. Yeah! Take that, scumbags! Oh shit! That hurt! Who the hell are you? Your savior. You're welcome. What's the name? Sarah. That's all you need to know for now. I think we need more information. Oh, do you really? What are you gonna do about it? It's four against one. I like those odds. I just think we should listen. What? Well, she did just save us. And that means we trust her. I didn't want to give you more information about me, but the reason I came here was the fact that this outpost is a target. Target? For what? Data. Those soldiers invaded because of the data that's stored here? Yeah, that's about it. But more Empire soldiers will arrive. And what about you? I work for Plasma Cyber, and I'm here to transport the data back to HQ. HQ? How big is this group of yours? I've already told you too much. What's so important about this data? I have no idea. You guys were shipped here, don't you know? I was never informed about anything data related. They sent me and my squad here for spreading coordinates. What? You know, if anything happens nearby, we'll be sent there to take care of whatever. Are you all stupid? Lady, I think it's best for you to leave. Not going to. Sorry for the insult, but I'm here for the data. Am I the only one who's confused here? Sergeant, you're telling me you didn't know there's secret data being stored here. Just for us to also be sent here, for what? To look like any other outposts? The hell I know! This sounds like complete bullshit! I don't know your guys' whole situation or why the NGDS sent you here, but I have to get that data. What about the soldiers? You said more will come. Won't you help us with that? Depends when I get my hands on the data. If I happen to find it before the soldiers get here, I'll help. And if you find it before then? The answer's pretty obvious. If she is telling the truth, I would want our defenses up to date. You and I make sure that they are all set. Yes, sir. Christ, this organization is a mess. Who takes care of these servers? Yeah, none of us do. I literally don't understand why the NGDS sent a group of idiots to a base with valuable data. Well, I would say you can ask them yourselves, but <laughs> I just remembered our radio was busted. Busted or jammed? Based on what happened, I say jammed. The radio's in good enough condition to be working. When's the last time you made contact? I would say, uh, about a few weeks, around the same time Eric arrived. That's when we lost connection. Which one's Eric? That would be me. You weren't with the rest when they arrived here? 
weren't here. I didn't even know them before. I was sent here to this outpost to do these spreading coordinates thing. And that's when you lost contact with command? Yeah. Well, either way, sounds like your problem. All right, we have some defenses. You sure that will hold? Of course it will. Barricade is a barricade. They're boxes. It will hold. Hey, asshole! You destroyed my barricade! Barricade? It was a complete pile of shit. Say that again. Uh, I have another trick up my sleeve! Shut up and listen closely. The leader will be here soon with more soldiers than any of you can handle. And unlike him, I'm willing to let you go. In return, I'm gonna need some of that data. Where the hell would we go? I'm not sure. Not my problem. Why is it everyone we meet is such a dick? Now, I suggest you all leave. I suggest launching a rocket up your ass. That sounded really gay. Uh, guys? What? Well, well, here they are. You did your whole I'll let you go thing, didn't you? Yeah, at least I gave him a chance. That you did. They're here. Maybe aim for the head next time. I'm sorry, I I got spooked. Took you long enough. It's only been a few hours since you informed me. Yeah, long enough. We can just spare them. Jin, you know the rules. Yeah, I know. It's just... not even once? Oh, and one of the soldiers from Plasma Cyber arrived. They must be here for the data as well. That's my guess. If there's one here, there will be more soon. How's the situation? What you see, lady? I'll take care of it. You guys stay here. <gasps> guys, I'm gonna make my way to the garage. What the hell are you doing? The thing I've been working on can help us if it works. Please work. Please work. Yes! What the hell was that? I assume that was his project he's been working on for a few weeks. Whatever it is, it's working. Oh, damn it. Peter, hurry! Yeah! Take that, you bastards! Dragon? Gates? Where the hell have you been? Sorry, Sarah. Unlike you, we don't have a vehicle. Oh, man. I just finished working on that. What was that? <sighs> My project. I called it Project Jade. Jade? <sighs> it sounded cool at the time.
Shit, that hurt. Whoa, don't like the look of that guy. Hey, purple, take this, Glover. Warrior, how the fuck? We better get going. I saw more soldiers making their way over here. Do we have the daughter? Yeah, we can get out of here. How about us? I don't know. Stay here if you want. It's no use. We have to leave. They could come with us. As long as these idiots don't slow us down, sure. They can come with us, but I can't guarantee Cyberplasma will allow them to stay. What? We can't trust them. You've got to be kidding me. Okay. Eric and Peter, we're leaving. I don't have any sights on them. Let them go. <sighs> Hey, Eric, come on. Yeah, sorry, it's just... I have to get used to another base. If we are able to... Hi, I'm Eva Fender, the voice of uh, Eric Coliseum, and I also happen to be the creator, director, and editor for this video. I never actually planned to do one of these at the end of my Mishimas, but since I found myself a lot more involved with the community, I might as well. I have this end note here because there are a few things I want to say, so this will take a bit. Please don't really waste your time with this part unless you want to know more about the future projects and stuff. If this is some sort of reaction video you're doing, you probably want to cut this out. Do it, Dan. You don't want this in your video, right? Anyway, so Sliver, what I'll be calling this project for short, is something I've been working on for half a year. That's more or so due to the fact of my schedule and the incredible personality of mine where I never get a project done quick enough. But I eventually got it done, leading to some other news when it comes to my original story mission of content. I will never, never split them into parts again, for that just unnecessarily separates the projects out over a long period of time, just like Sliver. So, for Genesis, which is the sequel, as well as any Rebels content, will be in full, like, session, in full video. Leading to unfortunate news, each project will take a lot of time, so expect one or two projects to be released in one e each year, you know, one year, you know, each year. When it comes to my other ideas, like Bobblehead Companions, this is meant to mimic a TV show kind of thing, so episodes of that will be spaced out. But I will finish the whole show before I do that, so that will take some time as well. Uh, one final note, these stories may be made with Halo, but they are entirely original. This universe is heavily inspired by Halo, such as Super Soldier is an alien religion pushing its species to war with the humans, 
and just other little similar details. The Wise Guy Slimmer is an adaption based on the novel and ride with the same name. Halfway through it, uh, in fact I am. It may be, was that Yoda? It may be released before Genesis even gets a Machina adaption. If you are interested, the first five chapters are on my readdom page. Links to that. Those chapters are also in the rough draft, so changes are likely to be made. It features a great many scenes that weren't even featured in this video. If you want to get to know the characters and lore more about this universe, check that out. Alright, sorry to take up your time, I really just wanted to point that out. I have a personal channel, The Slime Dars, where I do other Mishima content, gaming, live streams, and more. Check that out. Tell me what more like this. You know, uh, Mishima projects. You, you, you got it. Goodbye.